Today's a little bit different. This person who we're about to surprise already received a helping hand thanks to Devon James Injury Lawyers and Eyewitness News. Right now, we're going to go surprise him. The man we're about to surprise is Chuck Lowry. We introduced you to him at the beginning of June. The Great Plains United Methodist Disaster Response Team helped a lot of people who had their homes damaged in the 2016 Mulvane Flood. Lowry was the last one. Chuck, how are you? Hey, Scott Evans with Eyewitness News, Dustin Devon and Richard James. We're here to let you know that you received a helping hand without even knowing it. Great Plains was able to provide you some great relief, but you maxed out the amount of money you were able to do. And so Dustin Devon and Richard James actually covered the rest of it, and they wanted to come down and meet you today. Very nice to meet you, Chuck. We're very excited to help you get back in your house. Yeah, it's, yeah. Uh, I can't imagine what you've been through. I I don't know what to say. (laughs) Caught off guard here. (laughs) God bless you. The big expense for Cruz was finding a way to secure Lowry's cinder block basement. The flooding pushed in the walls. If it was not repaired, the home would have collapsed on itself. We were in a position where we were going to have to move. I mean, there there just wasn't any way around it because of the fact the walls were going to be coming in. He took us down into the basement to show us what was done. Uh, So everything's structurally sound now? Yeah. Oh, good. So that it's not going anywhere, not going to push, you know, push in and cave in. Now he's just watching for the next storm. Have you gotten any water since that time? No. Oh, good. No. No. It's uh, probably need rain at this point. (laughs) (laughs) That's probably true. Lending a helping hand. I'm Scott Evans.